Welcome to the channel. In this class, I am explaining about uh, equation of uh, straight line. Actually, the lines are in so many ways. Those are straight lines. Those straight lines are vertical and horizontal lines. Yes or not? But some lines are non-vertical lines. Those lines containing a slope, for example, that is theta. Yes or not? Actually, the lines, some lines are parallel to x-axis, some lines are parallel to y-axis. But without these uh, two lines, that means uh, parallel to x-axis and parallel to y-axis, those lines are non-vertical lines. Except these horizontal lines. Those are called non-vertical lines. But these non-vertical lines containing some slope. Okay? So, see here. Equation of straight line containing different forms. Number one is intercept form. And number two is containing one point and a slope. And number two is containing two points. Okay? So, in these cases, that means... In these three cases, how to find the equation of a straight line? This is very important for any geometrical points. That means for school level or college level or graduation level or PG, whatever it is. Okay? So, first of all, we want to know about what is meant by slope. What is meant by slope? Actually, this is a graph. This graph containing x-axis and y-axis and intersecting point of uh, x-axis and y-axis is called uh, that is origin that, you can, that can be called it as o you know that yes and this uh, coordinates are uh, 0 and uh, 0 x coordinate and uh, y coordinate okay now this graph uh, containing a non-vertical line this line touching y-axis at B and x-axis at O. Yes or not? And a point containing at the middle or some place in the on the line, in, some, in any place. That means P of x and y. For example, this point containing as uh, named as, as x1, y1. Okay? Now, this line containing a slope. Yes or not? But what is meant by a slope? Slope. Generally, slope can be called as m. Actually, this can be called as theta. Yes or not? That means angle. For example, this is a graph. And this is any line. Any non-vertical line. Making an angle theta with x-axis. This is x-axis. This is y-axis. This is line L. Now, making an angle theta with uh, theta, this angle is called uh, slope of a line. Slope of L. Yes or not? Generally, this is called. But uh, this slope, this slope contains different for different lines, different non-vertical lines. Okay? It is not constant. But, but uh, suppose the line parallel to x-axis and the line parallel to y-axis that is different. Yes or not? The line parallel to the slope of the line parallel to x axis is equal to zero. Yes or not? The parallel to the slope of the line parallel to y axis is undetermined. Okay? Now the slope is nothing but uh, the angle the angle making with uh, the axis that is x axis. Okay? This is slope. Okay. Now, in this figure, from this diagram, this geometrical figure, the line is L, which is passing through AB. Okay. Now, what is slope? This can be called as. This can be call it as M. Okay. Now, this is x y plane. In this x y plane, P is a point. 
in xy plane p is a point okay what are the coordinates of p xy actually this is a line slope of line slope of l because l is a line difference in y coordinates by difference in x coordinate is or not y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 you know that now what is slope of l m equals to y minus c by x i think what m into x equals to y minus that implies that y equals to mx plus c this is required uh, equation of straight line containing intercept form okay now intercept form equation see here a is uh, containing a 0 b containing 0 b why because here y coordinate 0 on x axis and y axis uh, x coordinate 0 you know that yes now intercept form equation how to find generally slope from the figure slope of AB equals to difference in y co coordinates B minus 0 divided by difference in x coordinate 0 minus A that is m s m equals to minus b by a this is slope of uh, this line l now what is the equation of straight line containing slope and intercept form that is y is equals to mx plus c containing slope and the intercept form yes or not what is slope now minus b by a x plus c what is intercept c here b that means implies uh, y equals to minus bx by a plus b y equals to minus bx plus ab divided by a lcm here a is lcm now a y equals to minus bx plus a b now divide through the equation by a b a y by a b minus b x by a b plus a b by a b ok this implies gets cancelled gets cancelled y by b equals to b b cancel x by a minus plus 1 this implies y by b minus comes to left side comes plus equals to 1 that implies uh, x by a plus y by b equals to 1 this is required uh, equation in intercept form containing intercepts as a and b but uh, here two differences are there one is containing slope and intercept form is y equals to x plus c and another one is intercept form is x by a plus y by b equals to 1 these are two differences which you have to observe here in intercept form ok first of all containing slope and intercept form that is y equal to x plus c and another one is containing intercepts a and b intercept of a x axis a and y axis b x by a plus y by b equals to 1 ok this is required uh, equation ok now the equation of straight line in the point slope form means what that means uh, whenever in a question containing a point and a slope at that time you can use uh, this formula ok how to find this formula here see the figure at this one this is xy plane p is a point on the line L, okay. This is line 
this is line here and this is slope that containing angle theta yes or not this is slope of the line containing angle theta and a point uh, x1 y1 how to find this generally equation of a line equation of a line containing slope m is y equals to mx plus c from 1 c equals to y minus mx this is number 2 yes or not now 1 is passing through x1 y1 x1 y1 so, y1 equals to mx1 plus c. Yes or not? Just we are replacing xy coordinates as x1 and y1. That's all. From this, c equals to y1 minus mx1. This is number 3. Okay? C here, please observe here. 2 and 3 are equal. Yes or not? 2 and 3 are equal. From 2 and 3 y minus mx equals to y1 minus mx1 from this y minus y1 comes to left side and this mx goes to right side minus mx1 plus mx yes now y minus y1 equals to m common minus x1 plus x that means y minus y1 equals to m into x minus x1 this is required equation of a straight line passing through x1 y1 and having a slope theta that is m ok so in this you can find the equation of a straight line containing slope m and uh, having uh, and passing through the point uh, x1 and uh, y1 okay now how to find the equation of straight line when two points are there simple here xy is a plane xy is a plane this is origin containing coordinates as 0 0 and A and B are two points this line L passing through points A and B ok now suppose there are two conditions are there one condition is if the line is non vertical that means L ok now first case if L is non vertical. In this case, uh, x1 not equals to x2. Here, x1 not equals to x2. Why? Why? Because, suppose, here, suppose 3, 4 is there. x coordinate is 3, y coordinate is 4. So for example, same manner comes to here. Here, from here to here is 3. Distance, yes or not? This is y coordinate, that is 4. From here to here is 3. From here to here is 3, that is x value. Yes or not? From the graph. Also, in the same manner, from here to here, that means here. Different, some 5 or 6, whatever it is. So, here x is equal to 3, 3, 4, for example. Here x is equal to 5, 6 or something. So, x1 not equals to x2. Yes or not? That is why slope of L equals to y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. You know that. Difference in y coordinates divided by difference in y coordinates. Also can be written as 
y1 y1 minus y2 by x x1 minus x2. Don't worry about that. Now, what is the equation of the line containing slope and point? y minus y1 equals to m means this one. m is this y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 into x minus x1. y minus y1 equals to m into x minus x1. This is m. Yes or not? Now, cross multiplication y minus y1 into x2 minus x1 equals to y2 minus y1 into x minus x1. This is required uh, equation of straight line when two points are given. So, x minus y1 into y2 minus y1 x2 minus x1 into y minus y1. In this way, you can find the equation of straight line when two points are given. This is very important uh, in geometrical format. In the classes uh, like uh, intermediate level and uh, SSC level or ninth class, whatever it is, school level and uh, college level. This case is lines are non-vertical. Now we can take uh, lines are vertical. B. If line is vertical, first case is non-vertical, this one. Now vertical. Here, x1 equals to x2. Why? Why? Because, see here, what is distance from here to here? x1. Okay, that is 2, for example. In the same manner, x2 also. Why? Because, this is x1 and x2. Take this, x1 and x2. So, both are same. x1 value and x2 value are same in vertical line. That is why, x1 equals to x2. In this case, equation of uh, L is x equals to x1, that's all. x equal to x1, that is x equal to k, yes or not? So, in this way, you can find the equation of uh, line when two points are given. Therefore, equation of line is x minus x1 into y2 minus y1 y minus y1 into x2 minus uh, x1 this is the required uh, equation of straight line when two points are given ok guys these are three different types of uh, formats one is intercept form one is one point form and another one is two point form Intercept form A is uh, two, two varieties are there. Those are containing slope and intercept. M and C. That is y equal to mx plus c. Another one is uh, containing intercepts A and B. x by A plus y by B equals to 1. And third one is one point form. y minus y1 into m into x minus x1. And another one is, uh, last one is, uh, fourth one is uh, two point form. In this case, uh, x minus x1 into y2 minus y1 equals to y minus y1 into x2 minus x1. These are four different types of uh, equation of straight lines. Pan slope and uh, points are given and two points are given. Okay guys, practice these problems and these formulas. These are very important for the computer exams and also for uh, public examinations. Thanks for watching. Like this video, please subscribe, like and share it. Thank you.